hello everyone welcome to my youtube channel today i'm going to show you how to create this logo in adobe illustrator so let's get started first of all choose a type tool and type your text in my case it is h and k type h Take a copy of this one and choose type tool again by pressing T and then double click. Type T, sorry, type K, which is our second character. Select both of these, right click and create outlines. Okay, now let me decrease this gap. right <clears throat> and now it's time to cut out this cave to merge to combine it with edge to do so select a rectangle tool and draw a rectangle like this so that we can cut the shape k okay now select shape builder tool Hold on Alt key and then drag the mouse like this to cut out the shape. Okay, now it's time to move this towards left side. Hold on Shift key and then move it towards left side and make it the position it like this. Decrease the stock size of the K. Uh, Okay, now it's time to select all the anchor points of the H and K like this. This one also, and then rounded them. I'm not getting the desired shape of the H rounded shape. Let me select both of them, and then our sides. downside this is fine now move it towards left side and position it like this and increase the size of this stroke size oh sorry it's up to maybe up to 1.5 enough i guess Yeah, it's looking fine now select that section tool or uh, select the upper point anchor points then hold on shift key and also select the bottom bottom points then click on any anchor point and move it towards ins inside to get the rounded shape okay i guess this is fine let me also give this edge some stroke to so that we can make it more thin. We can control it by increasing the stroke size. I guess at this point, it will look fine. But let me increase this one. Right? Okay, now this is looking fine. Now select all root object path and then select outline stroke. After that, choose shape builder tool and delete the all unnecessary lines. In my case, these And combine these three like this. Also, delete this one 
whenever you have to delete a sh uh, unnecessary part make sure you have selected shape blade tool and hold down the alt key all right this is fine now it's time to color it select both of them use eye dropper tool and click on this to apply the color to both the characters and then how make a circle like this there will be no fill to swipe this so swipe the colors increase the size of this stroke uh it would increase more connect both of them and then group with them let me change this color of this stroke to this by this to change it let me change the stroke color to this to do so make sure this stroke color is on the upper side then hold on shift e and your circle is selected then click sorry select eye dropper tool then and then hold on shift e and click on this and it will apply the color to the stroke of the circle all right we don't need this anymore okay so we have created the logo similar to like this if you want you can put it inside the mockup to do so you have to save first save first a png with transparent background and then put that inside the logo or directly copy them and press inside the mockup. I am going with second option, which is selecting them and add it, copy, and then go to your mockup, which is in my case this one. And you have to you have to your logo find your uh, smart object layer inside the PSD mockup. Once you find it, click double click on that. At the right bottom corner like this and then paste your logo in here increase the size of this one like this click here and hide the old one and then press save and then you can see that here is our logo under the, uh, inside the mockup, PSD mockup. So, thank you for watching. We have created our logo and then pasted it inside the PSD mockup. If you need this logo mockup, you can comment so I can give you it. I can share it with you. Thank you for watching. Take care and bye bye.